craft update number 12. Um, this one, I actually did film it once before, um, and then I deleted that video, and so I have to film it again. So, three of the crafts that I had, um, aren't going to be in this, but I'll just tell you. I had Peacock and Deep Ocean Blue, and I had a woven coaster of Peacock and Ocean Blue that was round, and then I had a square one that was Peacock and Blue with Peacock in the middle and just, um, a blue trim, so it wasn't, um... It wasn't weaved, but the other one, the circular one, was weaved. And then um, I had this peacock and uh, deep ocean blue and chrome wallet kind of thing. It wasn't like a bifold. It was like you open it up. It was kind of weird. I Oh, actually, yeah, I'll kind of show you the idea. So I'm just going to start with the first craft. It's this. Um, I messed up on it, so I didn't clear tape the chrome. I didn't cut down the edges. I just folded them in and I was done with it. Um, I don't think they're sticky at the bottom though. But this was kind of like what it was. I messed up on the measurements. That's why this one, I didn't finish this one. There's supposed to be like a short pocket. And I messed it all up so I didn't clear tape anything or anything. But this is what it actually looked, the other one looked like was this kind of idea thing with two hiddens, or two shorts. So two hiddens on each side, two card pockets and two shorts, or four card pockets and two shorts. But that was a mess up, so I hate that so much. Oh, it's so gross. I it can fit cards though. It's it's just really I didn't like it at all. Because it's like super tight. And here's the hidden. It's just super tight and gross because I made it too small. Yeah, so there's that. Then the next thing I have for you guys is this mini accordion with watercolor chevron. Now, funny thing is, is we were going to go see a movie and there was nothing playing that my brother wanted to see. And I wanted to see The Fault in Our Stars. Like, because I don't know, everybody wants to see that movie. I thought it was cute. But instead we ended up going to um, Walmart and I got watercolor chevron. And I got three rolls of it, so I'm so happy. And... There's a coin pouch with glad double zip. It doesn't sound like it, but when you close it up, it sounds like it. Listen. Yeah, so there is rounded edges. None of the eight corners have sticky in them because I know how to do that. And, um, yeah. Oh, so, yeah, I didn't get to finish my story, but the movie that we went, we're gonna, my parents were going to watch was called The Signal. And it was like this... IT movie, so my dad's like, hey, you should go watch it because you're going to be in IT when you grow up because that's what I'm going to be when I grow up. But uh, it didn't look too interesting, so we didn't watch it. Yeah. Now I'm just talking you guys' ear away. So then I did a bow. Um, I wore a chevron. And then I did this cup holder with electric blue. Pretty much everything I made with watercolor chevron, I either used electric blue or white. Or both. Um... Then I have this one. Um, this was supposed to be a swirly pen, but then I asked, or swirly um, flower, but then I accidentally kind of made it into a square form because I forgot to put do like the end. Yeah, it was just I don't like that. Then I made this. You've probably seen one just like it, um, and I um, made another one because somebody wanted one, so like for an order. So it's just on pink duct tape. It is actually. This, I'm not going to take it out of the bag, but it's that. It's clear, and so I just put it over pink. I guess pink goes good with everything. Then I have this from The Fault in Our Stars. It says, okay, okay, it's a bow, and I really like this. I'm gonna, I'm planning on redoing this because this isn't the way I was originally planning on doing it. It's supposed to say, okay, 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 you know? Yeah. So I'm going to probably redo it. I didn't have, I'm going to probably cut it out of my Cricut because I did this all freehand, and it's gross. And ugh. It's clear tape, though, and I really like this bow. And I'm talking really fast. Then I have this watercolor chevron pen with this little thing on the inside, continuous flower pen with teal. And I love making these um, continuous flower pens, bows, and mini accordions. These are like my three favorite things to make, guys, in the whole world. Other duct tape. Yeah. Or that. Yeah, so this just reminds me of old fashioned. I really like this. This has teal, or electric blue, sorry, not teal. Electric blue with the little flower petals. I like that a lot. It's really cute. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. 
Then this last one, I have, I'm going to have some more in the Chevron. It is all clear taped. And, um, I wouldn't say this is my best clear taping job, but it was pretty good for the most part. A few air bubbles here and there. It has an electric blue billfold with a fourth of an inch of trimming. I tried a new trimming out. And I actually tried a new size. I did eight and a fourth by um, three inches. And I think I'm going to start doing this size or um, eight and a half inches long because for hiddens, yeah. But I really like this wallet. So it has white card pockets. Um, I'm, deba I'm debating on whether I want to clear tape that pocket or not. I think I will, but I'm not sure. Three card pockets, no sticky. Another one right here. And this does look like it shows over, but it doesn't. Like, watch. I'm trying not to show you guys the design. See, it doesn't. Hold on, I didn't push it in. There we go. It doesn't show over. So, then I side ID with my frosted plastic. I did not get this from anybody. I got my own. So, yeah, this is my type of frosted plastic. It's really frosted, but it's still clear. Yeah. So, um, that, and then on the front, it says Buzz out of this. I freehanded this, um, saying Buzz. And this is part of my little cute, if you've seen my cupcake one, if you've seen my cupcake wallet, this is part of that series. And yeah, that's that wallet for that series. So, I'll be right back. In the last clip, I realized that this was uneven, so I just straightened it. Yeah, but that side's even. Okay. So, here is my scrap ball. So, I have three rolls of tape. And I'm just actually going to put this ruler, just set it right here. Bring it forward a little bit. You guys can kind of see. And if I, like, turn it this way, it's higher than three rolls of duct tape. So, it's kind of like lumpy. I'm trying to reform it, but it's not 100% working. But it's a little bit over three rolls of duct tape. So yeah, that's my scrap ball. So here are the two coasters I made. They're Peacock and Electric Blue. I know I said Deep Ocean Blue earlier, but they are Electric Blue. You can see the one on the left side is the woven circular one, and the one on the right side is the square one. Sorry for the bad picture. It I actually had to take it from my phone. So... Yeah, those are the coasters. Okay, so the last few things I have for my craft fair, or what am I saying? For this haul, or this craft update, um, yeah, I have a few more things. And keep in mind that I'm going to a craft fair um, in two days. Well, on Sunday. I don't know when this is going to be posted. But I should get some videos. I'm not sure if I will or not, though. So, first off, I have this comic book in red holder. Then I have a comic book and Deep Ocean Blue, and these are actually for an order. Then I have this little bobby pin holder. I put up a tutorial on it. And it's with retro tiles, or color blocks. I call it retro tiles for some reason, so owls. And fuchsia. And then I bought this glass, as you guys probably saw in my haul video. Um, this little jar, and I couldn't figure out what to put in it. And so I created a new invention, and I actually did post a tutorial up on them. Sorry, my camera is being stupid, as always. So let me, oh, um, actually I'm not going to open it, just because I put them in there exactly how I wanted them. So this one's comic book, they're all keychains. Comic book, um, Scotty Dogs, Union Jack, Wallflower, um, Bandana, Watercolor Chevron, and then Cut color blocks at the top and I'm gonna just have them on my table like this and people can go and look through them but I have them on like display but they can still buy these you know they'll just tell me oh I like this one in here you know so then I can just hand it but then I made that so that is it for this craft update I hope you guys like this video please comment subscribe and like this video give this video a thumbs up go check out my Instagram and my Twitter I'll link those in the description. We'll give the the thing to the description below. If you'd like to order anything from me, you can email me, PM me, or kick me. All those will be in the description below. Um, and, yeah. So go check out all the channels I link in the description below, too. Thanks, guys, for watching. See you guys. Bye.